After much bickering, Mahatma Gandhi's statue has finally been unveiled in Britain. Thousands were present for what has been a controversial issue with a group of Leicester residents suggesting that a statue of a local football hero was a better idea instead. It was to the strains of Raghupati Raghav Raja Ram, Mahatma Gandhi's favourite bhajan, that his statue was finally unveiled here at Belgrave Road in Leicester. Doing the unveiling, of course, were Home Secretary Alan Johnson, accompanied by the Hindu spiritual leader from the charity that's sponsoring the statue. And, of course, there was MP Keith Faz as well. The seven-foot statue sitting on a five-foot plinth, unveiled. This, yet another tribute to the Mahatma. Gandhi is an inspiration not to the British Asian community, not just to the British community, but to the community around the world. He was a hero to Nelson Mandela, a hero. He is one of the great political figures, and his message of tolerance and non-violence is as important today as it ever was in the 20th century. Fantastic moment. I think it's an indication of the breadth of our community, the way in which we are an inclusive city, and. Uh, this is all done by ordinary people doing these extraordinary things. It's a credit to them. Thousands were present for what has been a controversial issue with a group of Leicester residents who suggested erecting a statue of local football hero Gary Lineker instead of Mahatma. But finally, it was the Mahatma. The support that he had, the campaign has been given, especially from the media, Times Now, especially in India. Um, we, we have actually had the event take place today. The city of Leicester in East Midlands is now more than ever living up to its nickname of Little India. Its status sealed with this £20,000 seven-foot statue of Mahatma Gandhi. This statue, of course, is only the second statue of Mahatma Gandhi in the entire Britain. So who knows how many more there are still to come.